The Suzuki and Jeterio Lab is working to create new sensing materials such as dyes and to develop chemical sensors. By combining organic molecules, electrochemistry, and molecular biology, the aim is to create chemical sensors that are smaller, simpler, and more sensitive. Such sensors will have a wide range of practical applications. ま、in healthcare currently, MRI is the most representative imaging diagnostic method, but it's still difficult to identify first-stage tumors that are less than 1 mm in size. To detect such small tumors, it's necessary to develop contrasting agents that give sharper monochrome contrast than current ones, and also to selectively identify regions where tumors are present. The Suzuki and Jeterio lab is studying reactive molecules that can indicate specific regions, with the aim of developing more effective contrasting agents. ミセル状と言いまして、to achieve such advanced chemical sensors, it's essential to develop dyes. In particular, image analysis using near-infrared fluorescent dyes enable imaging deep inside the body without obstruction due to light absorption. So such dyes are currently topical in healthcare and bioscience. Recently, the Suzuki and Jeterio lab succeeded in developing a near-infrared fluorescent dye that's brighter than previous ones. It's called ま、そこ in addition, the Suzuki Jeterio lab is developing many other sensing devices that measure chemical substances accurately. These include flavor sensors that simulate the human sense of taste and sensors to detect toxins in the environment. To enable these sensors to become widely used in society, the lab is working to fabricate low-cost compact sensor chips using inkjet printing technology. あの、毎回あの、ちゃんと同じオートが選べるので、その測定の前にあの、ちゃんと検尿栓引くは必要ないので、さらに測定は早くなって、あの、ま、全体的なコストが下がるだと思います。Healthcare, environmental testing, and food hygiene all require chemical analysis, which plays an essential role in daily life. Chemical sensors are ideal tools for helping chemical analysis in that vital role. In the Suzuki and Jeterio lab, research students also participate positively. All students have their own specific individual goals. And by continuing to develop superior chemical sensors, the lab as a whole intends to help make life safer for everyone. <laughs>